This AI app made me $10,000. And the best part about this is I didn't write a single line of code. Today, we're gonna to be talking about Golex AI. So without further ado, let's dive into this. So here we are on Golex AI, and this is honestly one of the best vibe coding apps out there because you can create an app or a website in literally a matter of minutes simply by prompting an AI. So what we're gonna do here is look at this prompt screen here. It's giving us a, an example here. I want to create a task management app, or we could press one of these down here, portfolio for my own stuff, right? A blog platform if we want as well, or an e-commerce platform as well. But let's actually paste in what I've written earlier for an e-commerce website with a product catalog, shopping card, checkout processes, user accounts, reviews, admin dashboard, and mobile responsive design. So basically, this is a pretty meaty setup. Normally you'd have to pay a dev thousands of dollars to do this, but simply with Golex AI, let's press enter here and see what it comes back with. So here it says setting things up for you. It's setting up the initial code base. And then it's got a prompt that it's written for us based on our original prompt, which is pretty cool. And then it's going to start coding away basically with us on a hands-off experience here. So let's just let this thing cook and then we'll come back in a few minutes once it's made the site. So literally two minutes later, guys, we can see it's come back with a preview here of our site and it looks incredibly good here. So after two minutes here, guys, we can see that this has actually come back with a fantastic preview for an e-commerce site. And honestly, guys, this is all we would really need. We can see all the different products here with pricing, and we can even change this to mobile if we want as well. So if someone's shopping on their phone, they can actually see this and scroll down without any formatting issues. Now, normally with a developer or even a graphical artist or something like this, uh, they're going to have massive formatting problems where if you are going from desktop to mobile, it can be a situation where yes, uh, nothing displays correctly. And I've had this time and time again. So I've saved tons of money, thousands of dollars, simply by generating my websites using Golex. And uh, yeah, I mean, this is super intuitive. You can see this works fantastically. We can actually go into different sections of this app. So we've got the home section here. We can also go to the shop where it's created an entire store for us with different categories of products, which I think is fantastic. And then we also have new arrivals here as well and sale on the right hand side. Now, if we wanted to connect a database to this, all we got to do is go up to the top right and say connect Firebase. Uh, and Firebase is obviously Google's database storage. So it's going to ask us for a few things here. All we got to have is our Firebase configuration here where we would paste that in there, or we can manually enter it by filling all of this out too. So Firebase can be great for storing user data or anything else your users submit. And this is a great way to obviously have a save feature for your users. So if they have something in their cart, so for example, if we go back here to our app, if they have a bunch of stuff in their cart, then we can save that in our database for the next time they come to our store. We can also look at what they've purchased before, potentially recommend them similar products. So that's why Firebase can be really, really useful. We can see here, it might look a little bit complicated, but there's tons of tutorials online on getting Firebase set up. But we can also look at the templates section here where we can even manage different emails in which, yes, uh, it's basically an automatically send email verifications and all of this stuff. So you don't need to set it up. So to connect this to a Firebase database, it's super easy. And I'm going to walk you through it right here, right now. So we hit the connect Firebase button. And we're greeted with this screen. Next, we're going to go over to Firebase and we're actually going to create a project. Super easy to do this and free to do. But uh, we're actually going to type in ecom store. OK, doesn't really matter what the name is. And then, yes, we're going to press continue again. We keep pressing continue. We're going to add this to a Google Ads account. Doesn't matter what. And then, yes, we just let this thing work its magic. Now it says your Firebase project is ready. So we're going to have this here and we're going to press this web button right here. So once we've pressed this, it's actually going to give us the app registry. So what we're going to do here is just say, Ecom. Then we're going to press register app. And then you can see here that it's come back with a bunch of code. What we're going to want to do is copy this code and then we can use that uh, to actually link it up with Golex. Next, we're going to go to our project settings. And once that's open, we're going to go back to our web app and then we're just going to paste that configuration 
in here. And from that point, we simply press next. Next, we go back to Firebase. We head to the service accounts tab, and then we're going to scroll down and generate a new private key. From that point, it's going to ask us to download a JSON file. That's absolutely fine. This is from Google, so we know it's safe. And then one of the last things we've got to do here is go to the manage service account permissions. So let's just go to that, opens up a new tab. And here we can see a nice but complicated layout. But not to worry, all we're going to do is go up to this I am button. We're going to click it. And then if I move myself up here, we can see there are two little edit buttons here. We're going to select this edit principle button, and this is what comes up. So we're going to add another role here. We're going to type in Firebase admin. We're going to add that to the assigned roles. And then all we're going to do is save. And finally, if I move myself back and then go back to Firebase, this is where we're going to upload our JSON file that we just downloaded. So simply put that in there and you'll be good to go to connect to Firebase. So here we can see the Firebase checklist and yes, everything has passed with flying colors. So we're gonna press connect. And now the top here you can see the Firebase database is connected. Now that might seem complicated, but the steps are super simple. Just follow the video step by step and you're good. And yes, now we have this website working. We have a database connected to it. So that is good stuff. But let's say I want to add a Google login screen. So let's do that here. Type that in and see what it comes back with. So now we can see that it's actually given us a new login logo at the top here, as you can see in the top right. We're going to click that and now it says sign in with Google. So that can be synced up with our database. Everything could be working swimmingly. And yes, we can just chat back and forth with this AI assistant to make any changes to this site that we need. And uh, another thing I forgot to mention here, there is a quick view button that looks really, really cool that's implemented on its own in which you can see the product, you can add it to your cart uh, and everything, et cetera, et cetera. So good stuff there. That is Golex AI, definitely one of the best ones out there. And very, very simple to use, guys. It's literally just chatting with your developer robot friend, and he will go and make this site for you within 10 minutes. And honestly, guys, that compared to talking with a dev back and forth for months just to create something like this, I mean, yeah, this is much, much better and has saved me thousands of dollars, if not tens of thousands of dollars with the projects that I make. But how much does this actually cost? Well, if you compare something like this to actually hiring devs, getting all of this built out yourself, it's probably going to cost you thousands of dollars. But with Golex AI, you can see that literally the basic package here is only 20 bucks a month, saving you thousands of dollars. So that's something that's fantastic. And you can actually get a discount here if you use this code. And that is TDP 20. So once you do put in that code, you're actually going to get 20% off. Let's just see. Yeah, it's gone down to $16. So that is fantastic. Definitely use our link in the description so you can take advantage of this offer. So that is Golex AI. Remember, you can make anything. We've done e-commerce today, but you could do subscription models. You could do private content. Basically, anything you could think of, just get this bot to code it up for you and you will have a fully working site with a working database. Uh, and that is fantastic when it comes to getting your ideas into product format to make money as quickly as possible. That's going to be it from me. I will see you guys in the next video.